welcome back to another video. So today, um, welcome back to the Macrosis Fan Club. I hope y'all guys and I, I'm waiting. I know the like I say about, but anyways. So today we are going to be doing making slime. We're going to be making ladybug slime. Um, cat in the wall, and I'm going to be doing this because I really love making slime. And I, I kind of wanted to express it a little bit more on this channel, a little bit more, because I know I don't really do, like, fun stuff on this channel. Um, so, yeah, I thought to just do this. So, yeah, guys, so let me get my, I have my slides around me. I just need to grab my bowl, and I'll see you when we get Okay, so I'm going to use this glue bottle. I have one thing around me, and I have, ooh, no, my baking soda. Well, that's not all my baking soda. My baking soda is right over here. That was just a little cup of my baking soda that fell. There wasn't much in it, anyway. This is making my book fun. And now you don't really see me that much. Okay, so some slime. It's some mammoth glue. And we're going to make this. I have tied it. So we're going to make this out of um, contact solution. Ooh, baking soda. Out of contact solution, and my baking soda is on the side. So. So, yeah. And we have some red food dye. I don't have any black foam beads, but I do. I am going to pick out some black um, beads. I need to move that. So, yeah, let's get right into this macro thing. Looks like. I'm going to pour in our glue. Okay. Now I'm going to pour in a drop of red food dye. I know my bowl is kind of rusty dusty, but, you know, it's not giving me a really Marcos Ladybug color. It's giving me more here. Use this one to see how it is. This one's a little bit lighter. That, the one I first one I used was um, blue dye, but this one's acrylic paint. So maybe it'll be better. I'm not sure. I know it just looks like pink. Hold on. I'll be right back when I get to the color I want. Okay, guys. I'm back. And it wasn't working, so I just put some glitter in it. Whatever. Wait a minute, look at this color. I have different kind of reds. Maybe this one might do the trick. Oh yeah, it's getting more red. A bit redder. I do the trick. Sorry, there's a walker. But, oh, oh, no. Okay, so time to add our, let me just grab, put our baking soda 
You want me to add too much baking soda? Let it stir. I do also have um, I have Tide. Tide's behind me. Wax. A Tide right behind me. Ah, uh, I have the Big Tide. I have the Big Tide behind me. I also have the Mini Tide. I will show you the Tide for that. You can hit it up. Send as our context solution. You can see it's starting to activate. I'm sitting at my table where my this is the only place my mom really allows me to make slime. When it, like, my dad and my mom doesn't like it because it gets like really messy, so they said, Can we put it on this table? I just need a little bit more contact. I don't want to overactivate it, so I can't really see me a little bit, but the table is already kind of dirty, as you can see. I'm trying to scoop out all the, I'll get that rest in a minute. That's actually not too bad of slime. I'm just looking at something. Okay, so now it's time to pick out our black beads. Ooh, that's a lovely. Bead, bead. I know they're all beads, but I'm trying to find the black one. At least a few black ones. Yeah, I'll come back when I... I didn't want to get out all of them. That would take too long. So I just got a few. crochet over here because it's not very comfy like the chair so to have a crochet. I love that crochet. If y'all have watched the memes one let's go check that out. I love zebras and monkeys. I also like a zebra picture back there. I also have a few monkey stuff too. So. To the bubbles. It just makes it stretchier. A little bit of more stretchier type of texture. It also makes it smell good. So guys, I hope you all enjoyed this video. I mean, this is my first play book slime. Yeah, guys. Like, subscribe. Bye.